So behind me is the field where the dead bodies of Johan Botha, Sunei Botha and Jane Botha were found by the community on Tuesday around 3 p.m. Now the bodies were found on the back of a Nissan Bucky which was abandoned right here. Now one person has been arrested and Eyewitness News understands that the person that's been arrested for these three murders is also a member of the Botha family. Now this triple murder has shocked the community of Rondebals Extension 1, which is a pretty much quiet and um, suburban area that is not really used to crime like this. We have spoken to the community and we've spoken to the councillor and they're hoping that there will never be a repeat of this again. It's a small, small community. We believe some people know each other, some people are reserved uh, by, to themselves. And to find that a man has killed his father, mother and a sister, wiping the whole family lineage like that within a matter, this is shocking and appalling. Uh, I heard from the community and the neighbors that it seems like they were drugs, uh, the, 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 uh, their son, uh, he's smoking drugs, he, he's on drugs, so maybe he was high. Uh, it's an allegations, but we, we know everything. It's, uh, uh, it's investigated by the, by the police as we speak. Now, the 42-year-old man who's been arrested is due to appear in court over the next couple of days. Tabiso Goba, Eyewitness News, Germiston.